What's going on, A pluses, nerd mixes? It is your boy, Andy Uchiha, and I come to y'all guys with, with, with a heavy heart, a lowered head, because another one bites the dust. Um, as reported on comicbook.com, uh, we've talked about it here. We, we, we've been wanting, we've been praying that we were actually going to get the spinoff from uh, Green Arrow and the Canaries a go. And it has been confirmed that um, the Belanti verse is no longer going to continue on and that it has been axed, canceled or um, whatever. Um, it, it's weird. Uh, they spent so much time of the final, I'm going to say the final two seasons, about the end of season seven and um, the final season of Arrow, um, setting up what was supposed to be a spinoff for uh, Mia Smoke uh, and the Black Canaries, uh, Kat McNamara, uh, Katie Cassidy, and Juliana Harvey to have their own show. And for this not to come forthright or come to fruition, it, it, it hurts a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So it, it's pretty interesting in that aspect on how all the that was going to go. Um, I was really, really, really looking forward to this. I know a lot of people weren't cool with it. A lot of people didn't like the backdoor pilot. Um, but you know, I, I really, really, really enjoyed it. Um, I, I thought that, uh, Kat, um, coming from her shadow hunters, you know what I'm saying? Fame and the great job she's doing right now in the stand, you know, uh, that she would have not the star power, but at least the attraction for some to bring, uh, eyes. You know what I'm saying? Over to the show, but I guess what's going to happen. Now, I know when she signed on the show to play me a smoke that um, she did, you know what I'm saying? Had something to go on that she she was promised, you know, uh, um, she was promised her own show. You know, it's going to be a spinoff. Um, when the character even showed up, it was called Black Star. You know, I was thinking maybe that the show would uh, be called Black Star and it was follow, you know what I'm saying? Stuff that she did in the future or whether she was going to stay in the past. But it then turned into what was supposed to be an ensemble thing so maybe it was like a three-way star thing uh it was it was pretty interesting in what they were doing with that but as of right now we have no 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 green arrow the canary is happening as we see right here on a uh, variety the potential arrow spinoff about the canary is officially dead is cw um, Variety has learned plans for the show were first announced in September 2019, six months after it was announced that Arrow would end after its eighth season. A backdoor pilot aired in January 2020 as part of Arrow season eight titled Green Arrow and the Canaries. The episode took place two decades after the end of the original show and starred Catherine McNamara as Mia Smoke, Katie Cassidy as Laura Lance and Juliana Harvey as Donna Drake. My favorite version of Donna Drake, by the way. Uh, Cassidy began with Arrow on the show's pilot, though she was killed off in season four before she returned to season six. Magda Moore first joined Arrow in its seventh season, and Hark <laughs> excuse me, Harker V has been with Arrow since season five and also appeared in multiple Arrowverse uh, shows. Um, it goes on to tell DC fans not the threat as a number of new superhero shows currently in the works. You know, they got Wonder Girl, they got Naomi, they got the hopefully the black lightning spinoff of painkiller coming on top of the flash legends of tomorrow batwoman superman and lois um it seems that we would have a lot a lot a lot of superhero going but for those who are fans of arrow and wanted to see a continuation of what was going on with that story who all of us that wanted to see what happened to oliver's son you know what i'm saying he was kidnapped and just wanted to see how mia handled uh, that twist they handed at the end of the episode when her memories were returned, her fiance's memories were returned and and how that was going to work out and how it was going to be played was actually, to me, going to be very interesting. So it's something that I'm going to miss. Um, maybe there's a chance for it to come back later. I know they were talking about some type of sim simulcast 
what was supposed to be HBO Max and possibly um, the CW. I believe there's another show that it was going to do that too. So maybe it's something that could get life breathed into it on uh, HBO Max, or maybe it's just something they want to visit down the road and they want to let um, Oliver's legacy rest for right now and move the Arrowverse onto something else. Flash verse, Belanti verse, move it into something else and get uh, the shows away from, you know what I'm saying, revolving around this world that is Oliver Queen. You guys let me know what you think in the comments about this. I'm bummed about it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for all the news and reviews that we'll be dropping. Don't forget about A Plus Hero Report tomorrow at 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. And I can't wait to see you guys and see you guys in the chat and see you guys in these comments. So until next time, this is Indy Uchiha. This has been a Nerd Mix Indie.